Okay, so now in this video, I will show you how you can add different type of enemy characters or you can say opponent characters. So for the opponent characters, let's use this Lee character. Okay, this will be our second character. So you can drag and drop it in there, move it to the ground like that. Okay, and then you can resize it to 1.1, 1 .1, 1 .1 like that and it already has the opponent lee uh, controller so i'm just gonna drag and drop that in there okay just as we did for this jin kazama so drag and drop that in there click on prefab unpack completely then select jin kazama and lee click on create empty parent name this as opponent characters now click on Lee actually let me disable Jin Kazama because we don't need that now we will need to focus on Lee okay so first of all it needs the script so let me copy the script and paste it move it at the top then click on it again copy the character controller component so copy component click on Lee click on paste component as new that's it now the player characters are already added we just need to change these effects and also we need to provide this character animator controller right there Lee okay and also the character controller as well for the Lee okay make sure that you add that and now the effect as well so let me open these effects this is the Jin Kazama effects so the first the first effect third and fourth is in the right leg so if I open up Lee hips right up leg okay this is the leg so I'm gonna open it up and then I'm gonna duplicate these three effects and drag and drop it in there okay and when you do that click on restart there it is these are the effects first of all reset their position and then rename them as well okay now the second effect is in the left hand so I'm gonna open up spine spine 1 spine 2 left shoulder left arm left forearm left hand now in the left hand duplicate effect 2 drag and drop it in the left hand reset the transform and rename it actually let me reset it again okay and then rename it okay now let's close Jin Kazama click on Lee and let's drag and drop the effect one by one so one two three and four and now in order to confirm it that it's these effects click on it as you can see yes it is these effects okay so they works perfectly fine now okay so now for the opponent now we have two opponents okay so if you open up player characters select Eddie Horeg and King as you can see we now just have one uh, opponent on them so now we need to drag and drop Lee in there as well because now we have two opponents okay if you don't do that then your player character won't be able to damage this opponent okay so make sure that you drag and drop that and then let's start the game and when you start the game there it is place the effects perfectly fine as you can see now if you try to damage it we can damage the Lee as well if you click on uh, Lee as you can see its health is 90 if you damage it again it is 85 80 75 okay so it works perfectly fine and in this way you can add different types of opponent as well if you are still confused then i will suggest to re-watch this video again and try to add six opponent characters okay that is your job to do so now with our opponent second opponent added let's end this video right here